Right. So here I am in Bidgosh, otherwise known as Bromberg. There's a really old building. I like old buildings. That was the Hollerenzalleren building, whatever that means. It has something to do with the Germans. Anyway, this is the main drag. This is a, the Berda River behind me, which is very beautiful. It goes way up into Kashuba, near Gdansk, where it is a tiny stream coming out of a lake. And uh, Formagatsk, Formag at Fornagatska, Gatska, Fornagatska, I think, is near the area anyway. And there is, there's the port. There's three houses down there, the granary houses. The port, there's an old church for you, They're like old German churches. And this is the post office. There's a big building behind me. Isn't it marvelous, darling? Isn't it marvelous? I think it is. Yeah. People look at you odd when you're doing this, no matter, they can't get quite used to it, even though everybody does it. Yeah, this is a better view. Yes. And there. Sort of ornate Victorian house was built at the end of 19th century. Down there, you gotta watch it. See that bicycle guy? Look at him. There's a lot of crazy bicycle people. They don't seem very good at riding bicycles or thinking. But um, maybe it's just me. Anyway, oh, let's go back. Now you can see it as I go back to the car. I like this building. There's something about that building. It's got a good restaurant in there where they have creme brulee. It could be exactly why I'm uh, fond of the building because they have creme brulee. Creme brulee. Creme. Sorry. 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 Anyway, that's your view. The main part of Old Port of Bidgosht. Boy, in the Middle Ages, this place was hopping. The 1300s to the early 1400s through the 1400s and 1500s actually up to the Swedish invasion this place rocked 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 around the clock indeed there you are goodbye Bitkost see you next time